everyone uh, welcome to today's video I know it's been a few weeks since my last one um, but I just didn't quite feel that inspiration to speak um, so I've been posting a lot on Instagram and Facebook recently um, so hopefully you've been seeing that instead I've also posted some videos of nature um, just a few seconds in each clip and um, hopefully you're enjoying that as well Today I wanted to spend a little bit of time talking about stuckness. And when I say stuckness, this is something that you can relate to more than you can relate to the term itself, because I think the term sounds a little bit silly. But it's a reference to an experience of feeling like you're not living your passion, you're not sure why you're waking up in the morning or going to work or going through whatever routines that you're going through. It feels a little bit like you wake up, you go to work, or you go through whatever it is that you're going through in your day, you go home, you get in bed, rinse and repeat. And um, that feeling is really disheartening over a period of time if it's not something that you enjoy, um, or if you're not doing the job that you feel like you should be doing, or not living your dream. And a good way to assess whether you're actually doing what you love is to just check in and say, how am I feeling today about doing this? Do I feel good about waking up in the morning and committing to the obligations that I've committed to to pay my bills? Or am I getting up energized and ready to get to my day and ready to get to that paperwork or working with people? And um, yeah, if you answer that question, you're kind of sitting there like, you know, I'm, I'm just not too sure if this is what I want to be doing. And then you're answering the question, you, you probably feel a little bit stuck. And that's totally fine if that is what you're feeling because it's an opportunity first of all it shows that you're paying attention to your feelings and to your experiences and secondly it's an opportunity to um, start doing something else so what can you do once you realize that you're in that stuckness well the first thing would be to maybe start jotting down some things about what you're passionate about what are your hobbies what makes you get out of bed in the morning what makes you come to come back home smiling. Um, those are the things that are gonna let you know what direction you should be taking. The second thing that you could do is consider seeing a therapist because we are really good at teasing out what the motivations are, um, what your values are, what your passion is, and the different factors contributing to what you're experiencing, such as your family, your relationship, your kids, your job, and the third thing that you could do is um, start putting yourself around people that you admire. Um, so evaluate the people around you in your inner circle and in your family and see which ones are really most supportive of your, your lifestyle or healthy decisions that you're making or unhealthy decisions that you're making. Because there are people around you that are really supportive and loving and want you to do well and then there are people that really might just want you to be in a not so good place. Um, so that's really something to think about. And the fourth thing which might not surprise many of you um, is I'm gonna recommend meditation because when you're not just going through the day-to-day -day, when you're engaging in deep breathing and peace and calmness inspiration and answers sort of arise um, and it feels like it's coming out of nowhere but really it's coming from your subconscious which in while you're awake, it's not activated, uh, or at least uh, it's not communicating actively with your conscious mind. Which I'll hold off on going into detail about because that is a whole other video. I hope that you take some of these things into consideration and uh, tune in for my next video, which I am not promising will be next week because I might get caught up in uploading more pictures and videos of nature because I just really enjoy it. <laughs> All right, take care everybody.